shipbuilding companies around the world are designing the next best type of boat, and they have a lot of great ideas. So, join me for today's video as we take a look at the top 15 most impressive future boat concepts. Number 15. Missouri Yacht Kicking off the list is a killer concept from the folks at Chiron Design, the Missouri Yacht. Announced in 2019, the futuristic Missouri Yacht is a 230-foot-long beast and can take you almost anywhere on the globe. With a max speed of 22 knots and a range of 4,000 nautical miles. And if you don't feel like lounging around the deck anymore, you and some pals can take to the seas yourself with its six jet skis and two tenders. While the all-steel and fiberglass exterior may come off as intimidating, things get a little fancier when you step inside and are greeted by its wood and marble interiors. On top of the large crew that it takes to keep this ship up and running, it can comfortably house up to 20 guests in its 10 cabins. Hate sharing living space, though? No problem, because the master suite will have you thinking you're in your own apartment with a private deck, shower, bathtub, and a sauna. When you come onto the main deck, you're treated to a full 360-degree view of your surroundings, a full bar, pool, jacuzzi, and even a nightclub. Yep, this super yacht comes decked out with space for a nightclub. This is the one time you'll never have to worry about being on the list. Chiron Design also teased that two Audi AI Trail Quattros will be parked for your enjoyment as well. The Trail Quattro is an unreleased self-driving electric vehicle, and I'm pretty sure the model will drop at the same time as the Missouri Yacht. Now, you may be asking yourself why you need to have two cars on a super yacht, but at that point, two Audis are just a drop of the ocean. And if you're going to have a couple of fancy cars on your yacht, then it's better to have a fancy helicopter to match, because the Missouri Yacht is going to have a helipad on the rear deck. You'll be thinking you're a Navy SEAL, because this bad boy's ready to have some fun on land, sea, and air. Number 14. The Boss the designers of this future boat concept are so confident in their work that they simply named it The Boss. Created by Charlie Petussi and the French yacht designer Julian Cardo, released their own yacht concept. The Boss has an incredibly sleek design that looks like she's ready to cut right through the sea like a hot knife through butter. This concept yacht is 262 feet long and has three decks, plenty of designer furniture, and an outdoor cinema and concert space, plus an affinity pool if the ocean isn't warm enough just yet, and a one-car storage space. So if you want to try and test your land legs after a weekend out to sea, you can just back the car right out of the boss and hit the open road for the next adventure. And if you don't want to do that, head on up to the upper deck and you're greeted with a full bar and open dining area with sweeping ocean views, some VIP guest cabins, and of course, the stellar owner's suite. And while many yachts have a helipad, the boss takes it to the next lever with a helipad large enough for two helicopters. Number 13. Project 3073 Another super yacht in the works and inspired by the Jaguar E-Type is the Project 3073. The Dutch designers Henk de Vries and Tano Vida were tasked with designing the new super yacht, and boy did they deliver. Project 3073 is a sports yacht that looks like something out of a science fiction movie, and with an all-aluminum design, it's meant to run like a sports car. Instead of using propellers like most yachts, the design involves a water jet propulsion system, allowing it to travel at speeds of up to 30 knots. If you were on land, that's about 40 miles an hour. But what really ties everything together is the full-size glass-bottom pool, so you can feel like you're taking a dip in the big blue without having to leave the comfort of your super yacht. But like so many other mega yacht concepts, Project 3073 hasn't quite left the drawing board just yet, but will hopefully be made available within the next few years if shop builders and contractors can muster up enough cash. Number 12. Migaloo Submarine Yacht the term submarine yacht may sound a little bit strange, but it'll all make sense when you're on board. Carrying a hefty price tag of $2.3 billion, this luxury vessel built for private use starts out as a mega yacht, but things really get interesting when it submerges below the water's surface. It's any billionaire's dream toy. The Megaloo can reach a depth of 1,500 feet and cruise underwater at 20 knots and is the most expensive privately owned yacht in the world and does sound better suited for a Bond villain than it does an everyday person. 
On the surface, guests can enjoy the pool deck, the bars, the pool, the jacuzzi, and the beach club. But when it's underwater, the vessel's interiors become glass rooms that give some seriously breathtaking views of any fish that you may come across. And when it does function as a submarine, there are still two mini-subs sitting in the tenders for when the owners need even more alone time. Number 11. Kairos by Ocean Co. The Kairos by Ocean Co. was shown at the Monaco Yacht Show with the goal of changing the way people think about yachts forever. For starters, this concept is massive, coming in at 295 feet long and combining asymmetric shapes and transparent structures throughout, and opting for as few physical barriers as possible to provide a more minimal design. The standout feature of the Kairos is the massive piazza that lets everyone on board live in a true lap of luxury and feel like they've finally made it to Italy. Guest suites can be found throughout the lower decks, but as you make your way towards the top, there's a balcony offering 360-degree views of the ocean. But as you look down, you'll be able to witness the Kairos's asymmetric shape and no clear bow, meaning the ship can move in either direction, forward and backward is just a concept here. The idea behind the Kairos is that it's a moving, living island rather than a typical super yacht, and those 360-degree approach lets guests connect with their surroundings in literally every direction. And like so many futuristic boats, the Kairos is made with sustainability in mind, with an all-electric propulsion system and diesel hybrid configuration. The boat moves along the ocean without making any noise or vibrations, so you'll feel like you're not on a boat at all. Number 10. Project Centauro in 2019, the Italian design company Officina Amare revealed the design plans for what they call Project Centauro. Taking inspiration from naval vessels and spacecrafts of tomorrow, Project Centauro is 360 feet long, or the length of an American football field, and powered by two MTU engines and steerable water jets that give it a max speed of about 20 knots. This futuristic design has a sleek black hull and helipad, so you don't have to wait for the ship to dock for your next rendezvous. Some of the amenities will include living space for up to 14 people, an entertainment area, a diving station, an indoor pool, and observation lounge. Much like the Nazuri yacht, you'll quickly run out of reasons to leave and will hopefully become a reality by 2022, and she's looking to be one of the world's first hydrogen-powered super yachts. She's also got a massive helipad in the bow for when the rich and famous want to hop on board after she's already left port. Number 9. Apache by Tankoa Tankoa yachts put their heads together again to come up with their insane Apache concept. The vessel as a whole is absolutely awesome, but I can't move on without addressing the elephant in the room. The giant 31-foot flying glass-bottom pool that hangs in the bow between the upper and main deck the pool starts at the foot of the bed at the owner's suite and filters the light through to the semi-open lounge and gym on the deck below. It's pretty stunning and a great way to spy on your guests while having some fun and cooling off in the process. But from the floor of the pool, you'll see the lower deck's beach club with folding side terraces that are meant to look like a resort spread across 1,300 square feet of space. And amongst all of that is, naturally, the Apache's second pool. But when you fold those platforms closed, you'll expose the one-way glass that's the same color as the ship's hull to create a level of privacy you can't normally find on your average mega-yacht. And while the Apache provides guests with stunning views at every turn, nothing comes close to the view from the observation lounge or the crow's nest. Number 8. Scintilla by Tilburg Design Measuring a staggering 393 feet long is the future boat concept known as Scintilla. Created via collaboration between Dreamliner Yachting, Tilburg Design, IYC, and Laurent Giles Naval Architects, the Scintilla is on track to be an absolute masterpiece on the sea. When all is said and done, she'll be big enough to house 36 guests and have 44 crew members and puts fuel efficiency at the forefront. She'll have hybrid engines and a combination battery and alternative fuel system, and all of her interior and exteriors have been carefully thought out to use strictly environmentally friendly materials. And while saving the planet in style is certainly a great idea, the real fun comes from all of Scintilla's toys. Instead of harboring your standard water vehicle like a wakeboard and paddle boards, the Scintilla will have a dedicated area with more than enough room for a foldable catamaran, amphibious vehicles, cars, jet skis, quads, a helicopter, a seaplane, and even a tender for a submarine. 
This mega yacht concept is off the chain, and chances are you'll be spending most of your time flying overhead, and then eventually landing at the helipad of the multi-story owner's quiet and relaxing private jacuzzi. Number 7. Merville 325W by Merville Yachting When it comes to boats, yachts, and luxurious mega yachts, the French really know what they're doing, and the Merville 325W is no different. This boat concept is a 253-foot sailing yacht that stands out from your typical massive luxury vessel. First and foremost, the 325W looks to reduce fuel consumption and increase efficiency exponentially using a new wind-assisted propulsion system that doesn't require rigging. Think of it as a sailing yacht. The Merville 325W uses fully automated ocean winds that are capable of rotating up to 360 degrees with an adjustable camber and twist that can retract when furled. When the ocean wings are deployed, the boat's underwater turbines regenerate the kinetic energy that will in turn recharge the battery packs. But the energy and earth savings don't stop there, because this boat design is also equipped with wind turbines and solar panels to really up the ante and make sure everyone on board has clean energy going 24 hours a day. Number 6. 150 by Meyer Yachts While Meyer Yachts may be just a startup company, they've certainly got some skin in the game so far and are looking to prove themselves big time with their futuristic yacht design concept. The 150 from Meyer Yachts is absolutely huge. It's nearly 500 feet long and has a whopping six decks packed to the brim with all sorts of fun and luxurious accommodations. The 150 has more than enough space to hold up to 44 guests, all of whom can enjoy luxury amenities like the two-level spa, a billiard room, an entertainment area that includes a stage, a huge infinity pool, an actual movie theater, and even a full-on art gallery. The 150 yacht concept is more like a small neighborhood than it is a seafaring vessel, and once you get on here, you'll never want to leave. Seriously. But as you would come to expect, the 150 yacht concept is powered by fuel cells and battery banks, meaning this boat doesn't generate any carbon emissions, as the system generates 25,000 kilowatts that allow it to travel at a pretty swift max speed of 23 knots. Not bad for a 500-foot mega yacht. Number 5. Pure by Feedship The next future boat concept on this list is Pure Bliss. The Pure Mega Yacht is designed by Feedship and was unveiled at the Monaco Yacht Show. And while on the surface it may seem like your average 268-foot luxury mega yacht made for billionaires, there's one key feature that sets it apart from everything and anything else sailing in the world's oceans. Not only is the pilot house located below deck, but it's housed in a cabin that uses augmented reality visualization that connects radar, maps, AIS, depth sounders, and exterior cameras to keep the pilots on track. It's a pretty stellar feature that allows the captain and crew to have a little too much fun. It's the type of helm that you're only going to find in vessels like submarines, and so the pure may just be the first of its kind. But when you're ready to leave the amazing below-deck helm, you can make your way up to the three decks up top with a built-in elliptical glass atrium and retractable glass-bottom jacuzzi, and a huge beach club with three fold-down balconies. The atrium exists both half inside and half outside, so guests can enjoy it no matter what the weather's like. It's a pretty stellar installation, and the interior uses all-natural light to illuminate the vast central space. Number 4. Avangardia the Avangardia concept is designed by Pierpaolo Lazzarini of the Lazzarini Design Studio. And while the studio has certainly released plenty of amazing concepts and designs, this one seems to be the best one yet. The Avangardia translates to Vanguard in English, and this is definitely the vanguard of the Italian mega yachts. But this design takes its concept from the shape of a swan, with the top tier holding the vessel's control tower, which is also completely detachable. The bridge of the Avangardia is also fully extendable, and the bow can be lowered down to the center of the vessel while it's out to sea. It's pretty interesting design choice that really makes it unlike anything else on the market. And when she's extended, the Avangardia is 515 feet long, which also makes her one of the largest yachts in the world. But as I said earlier, her control tower is completely detachable and becomes its own separate boat. The rest of the Avangardia is divided into five stellar main decks, with the rear deck comprising of personal port for two jet capsules. And while the mega yachts may have enough space for one helicopter on board, this Italian vessel has enough space for two. Why does anyone need two helicopters? Well, who cares? If you've got it, flaunt it. 
but this mega yacht really takes things up a notch with its fully electric twin side engines and central MTU Rolls Royce jet engine that lets it hit a max cruising speed of 18 knots. And while the future price tag of the concept is still up for debate, it's probably going to take a whopping half a billion dollars to build the Avangardia. Number 3. Thor Explore The Thor Explore looks like it's on track to be one of the coolest and most epic mega yachts of all time. Put together by UK-based studio Gresham Yacht Design, they opted for a more inside-out approach when they cooked up their Thor Explore. They really went all out with this vessel's interior by incorporating large nautilus windows coupled with the floor-to-ceiling aquarium that allows the yacht to seamlessly blend in with its aquatic surroundings. It's the type of place that will make you forget that you're on a boat and make you feel like you're in a palace on the ocean. It is absolutely stunning, but to add to the luxury and convenience of the Thor Explorer, it's got a glass floor and walls that can go from clear to opaque with the simple flick of a switch. And while the Thor Explorer is no doubt incredibly expensive to build, this glass feature is easily the most expensive aspect of the yacht. It isn't just a mega yacht, but it's considered an explorer vessel as well, and it's about 300 feet from bow to stern. Aside from amazing guest rooms and a killer owner's suite, the Thor Explorer has an awesome sunken seating area with an onboard beach club and, of course, a helipad for anyone who may have shown up a little too late to the party. Number 2. Carapace What's cooler than sailing on the ocean? How about diving deep below the surface to see what lies beneath? Well, the future boat design concept known as the Carapace will let you do exactly that. The Carapace is a hybrid vessel from the Italian naval architect Elena Nappi, who came up with this wild idea after years of nautica experimentation and research, and said she wanted to combine the chillness of luxury yachts with an element of privacy. Only she took things to the next level by providing that privacy completely underwater. No one is going to see you down there. The Carapace could and should usher in the next era of passenger vessels when it hits the water in the near future, and will offer an experience that very few can. Because of its dual action, this concept is just 255 feet long, which is somewhat smaller compared to some of the other mega yachts we've seen today. But it still offers all sorts of accoutrements like VIP cabins, a bar, a full gym across her three deck levels. Plus, she'll use a diesel, electric, and fuel cell system, meaning her carbon footprint is all but non-existent. And because such a design is so extreme and forward-thinking, even Elena Nappi, the designer, admits that it's going to be a good long while before it's ever built, and it's going to take a ton of money to make this submersible dream a reality. But one thing's for sure, the carapace will be worth the wait. Number 1. Earth 300 Okay, we finally hit the mother load. Each year, mega yachts tend to put out a combined total of 2 million tons of CO2, and so the Earth 300 mega yacht concept looks to turn all of that around. That's because it's going to run entirely on nuclear energy. If the Earth 300 becomes a reality, it will almost be a thousand feet long, which is almost twice as long as the largest mega yacht in existence, the Abu Dhabi royal family's Azam. This vessel truly stands out with its design that's as sleek as it is bold and will have a built-in 13-story sphere that will house two dozen laboratories for scientific research and gathering data from all of the ship's travels to find solutions for the climate crisis. The Earth 300 mixes luxury with science and conservation and will truly be one of a kind. The research sphere will feed into the open source platform that allows the entire global community to participate and will be fully supported by a state-of-the-art quantum computer, the first of its kind that employs the properties of quantum mechanics to achieve a level of speed and power the world hasn't seen. The Earth 300 looks and feels like it's from an old episode of Star Trek and will hopefully propel humanity into a more peaceful and sustainable future. But the Earth 300's quantum computer is still just an idea, and it could take years before it ever leaves the drawing board. Without this supercomputer, though, there is no Earth 300. So, hope that the folks currently working on it at Google and IBM can turn their dream into a reality. When all is said and done, the Earth 300 will have a 425-person capacity, with half of that number being scientists and the other half being crew. What an awesome concept.